hello guys welcome to today's video and this is a TS Tech Talk video so on today's video guys I'm going to show you how to actually install and make use of vidIQ but I'm not going to be showing you guys everything we are going to be doing on vidIQ today I'm actually going to take some time to make um, a video individually for different things you can do on vidIQ but this is actually just an overview now quick note guys I already have um, a vidIQ account but for the purpose of this video, I'm going to be logging into that. So once you have your application open, just click on vidIQ after you've searched. I don't always memorize the URL, but it's actually very easy. Just type in vidIQ.com and it's going to open the vidIQ website. So I don't usually memorize it. That's the reason why I search for it on Google all the time. So let's search for it and wait for it to load up. Alright guys, so this is open. Normally you need to sign up or you log in, but I'm going to click on login because I already have an existing account. So it's going to actually ask for my um it's going to ask for my email address and I'm going to enter in my email address that is signed up with this um vidIQ and it's going to sign it up. So let me wait for that to load up. Uh, guys, um actually I was having issue with network back and forth. I really don't know what was going on, but I actually got in. So um, after you logged into your vidIQ dashboard, this is what it's going to look like. This is going to be your views. You can notice the views is actually climb, climbing within seven days. But although my subscribers and my watch time have actually dropped, the reason is because the view that is actually trending on my channel is actually not um, not a uh, not a video I uploaded is actually a short video that is making it to trend so that is the reason why I have that and if you scroll down you are going to see a lot of things right here on your dashboard but I do not actually spend too much time on my dashboard so I spend a lot of time making use of the application on the YouTube platform I have my own personal reason but uh, for your own case you can always come here and check all these things to know how um, how you can actually achieve that there are so many things right here you can actually click and you can see most of them are actually paid but the daily ideas it gives you like three daily ideas like every day just like it does give you on the mobile version of the application is very very similar so it's going to give you like three daily videos like every day you notice this is actually um, three fun facts about Bitcoin that you didn't know and this is a gala game so it's going to definitely give you video ideas like every day so these are all the video ideas and this is a video idea based on mobile game and this is actually something that is going to trend and below this section is actually a personalized video idea so you should just pay attention to all of these stuff and if you are not ready to make the video you can just go ahead and click on this heart icon when you click on that icon you actually confirm that you want to save it sincerely guys i actually want to save that video title because that is actually very unique and this is also unique i actually want to make video consigning those three and all of this is actually always recommending all this to me that is because i started this channel by playing video games so it's recommending um contents that are related to video gaming i'm actually going to pay attention to most of those so i save them and every time you save your content is always going to be on your video idea you can notice this area where it says saved video ideas you can always come there and you see all your saved video idea but guys i'm going to i do not want to spend too much time on this because almost everything here if is self-explanatory this is the one i missed which is actually the one i snap swipe out of you can always see them right here they are always saved for you you can always come back and look at them and anytime you want you can always click on remove all and it's going to remove everything just as simple as it goes but actually the main thing i want to do is to download the extension which is actually the most interesting part or the most important part why i'm making this video so we actually need to download the application all we need to do after we click on the download button is to click on add to chrome so just like tubebuddy this is also a google chrome extension and it's not a standalone application that uh, stands on its own which means it's not an application you can launch from your desktop but it's an application you can launch from your browser just like all this application on this top area they are all extensions so this has completely installed and you can notice it displays a notification right there 
and you can see YouTube giving um, Google giving you a notification that an application is installed. I'm just going to close that out. It's going to show you a successful installation and um, an interesting thing about vidIQ or probably all of them, they always welcome you and they always show you a welcome video on how to set up and keep going with your application. This automatically pops up this video and I'm going to pause it because it's actually a vidIQ video. But I, I, I recommend you guys to actually watch Hello, this. But since you are already watching my channel, there is no need to watch that because this is going to extend and it's just going to make things look a bit confusing for you, especially if you are new to YouTube. So um, the next thing you need to do is to click on this extension area on this top right hand area and you have to click on pin extension and it's going to pin it on this area. You can notice this is it. So, oh, I thought I paused this video. It did not pause. So this is the vidIQ. Anytime you want to launch it, you can always come and click on it and you'll be able to launch the application and you see everything you want displaying right on this area. And you can notice I'm already logged in. So um, let's close that out. Let's close this out by clicking on this area. Now you can notice the video is playing and you can notice on this right hand area, this is actually the video that we are displaying that is playing right now. And this actually has a lot of more information compared to what I showed you guys previously on the other application. I'm no longer going to mention the name. So it's going to show you how this channel was doing, performance, daily activity, the country, the person posted it, how many view it has gotten so far within 30 days and how many view, um, how many subscriber it gained and also um, actually how many subscriber for this channel and average sub and you can notice also the subscribe subscribers are growing by 20 and you can also see everything right here. And if you scroll down on this particular area, this is also very important. Pay attention to this particular section, guys. Um, video tags, and this is channel tag. Pay attention to them. They are very important. You should also monetize. You should also edit your channel to have all of those. And it's actually going to be interesting. And you can actually copy all of this, but um, that is going to be for a different video. Um, normally, if you are making use of um, the vidIQ Premium, you can copy this individually, but you can also copy this if you are viewing from mobile. I'm going to show you guys how to do that later on, um, reusing all of this stuff. And you can notice how the video is looking very cool. And you can notice you can still click on this historical session, but this is not available for you. This is actually where the person tweeted it and you can click on open and see where the person tweeted it. And also you can also see what is trending based on this channel. And if you go back to your own channel, which is studio section of YouTube, you are going to also see how my own channel is doing and also how it's going to display the YouTube, um, how it's going to display the vidIQ icon for you. So let's wait for that to load up. All right, guys. So um, I have opened to my st um, studio section and this, you can notice um, this section right there. This is actually for... Um, vidIQ and this is actually um, a, an achievement I just reached I didn't even know I just reached this achievement and if you click on this menu you can see um, even more things that you can click on I'm going to go through that later on and you can also see um, how it's going and you can see everything right here and guys there's a lot of things you can do on this application making use of the application so i'm going to be explaining each and every one of them on a different video um if i continue on this particular video it's going to take even longer so there is this particular video i need to publish so i'm going to show you guys how to actually work on your seo making use of vidIQ by publishing this video so um i hope this video is helpful to you guys if it is don't forget to smash like and subscribe to the channel i will see you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace